DJ Lewis, plumbing crew chief, he, him pronouns. I work in the maritime division for the marine maintenance department. As plumbing crew chief for marine maintenance, I manage a team of six. We work all along the waterfront from South Park all the way up to Shoal Shoal Bay Marina, working on all the plumbing systems, pumps, lift stations, domestic water, natural gas. I first started here at the Port of Seattle Marine Maintenance in 2016. I started as a journeyman plumber on the team and as of four years ago, I became the crew chief. What I enjoy most about working for the Port of Seattle is that this organization really cares about societal issues. And even though uh, my main work, my core work is plumbing, they let me include things like equity, diversity, and inclusion. I was able to be a leader on the D&D Council a couple years ago. I'm also involved with continuous process improvement where I'm a lean specialist. So working here for the last seven years, I've been able to grow, um, not just as a plumber, but in other avenues as well. The skills needed to be successful in my role is <laughs> number one, patience. Number two, multitasking. You gotta be really good at multitasking. We deal with a lot of emergency service calls, so you need to be able to um, move on your feet fast, um, know how to uh, provide great customer service. Skills that I've gained since I've worked here at the Port of Seattle seven years ago, I've um, become a cross control specialist. I've become a backflow assembly tester. I have become a lean specialist. I've become a leader on the D&D Council. I'm also a leader on the Happy ERG. Um, so a lot of different things that I've been able to um, grow in since I've been here at the board. So when asked about what my favorite project is since I've worked here, it's hard to pinpoint one because we work on so many things. We've worked on um, complete shutdowns at the airport, replacing 12 inch water lines to uh, replacing domestic water lines under dock. We've done a lot of amazing things, but really if I had to choose one project, it'd be too difficult. So what I'd say is what I'm most proud of is that my team can respond to so many different things and make customers happy around the board. So a current project we're working on right now is replacing a bunch of six inch old galvanized pipe that's under dock at Terminal 91. Uh, we'll be working on that for years. We have to replace that with stainless steel, which is better for the marine life. And um, the pipe there is just failing like a lot of our infrastructure around here. My biggest accomplishment since I've been in the crew chief position the last four years would be uh, growing the team. So we've been able to hire an apprentice in the last two years. And also we've expanded to um, a six member on the team. And I'm hoping that continues. I wouldn't say that I chose the port, I'd say that the port chose me. I uh, had a child, he was three years old at the time, and a friend of mine that worked here asked me if I was interested, and I did have my daughter on the way. So it was a decision I made to spend more time with my family, and I'm glad I did, because the port provides that, more time spent with my family. Uh, what I really enjoy about working at the port also is that part of my core work can be things that are extracurricular, like ERGs, and volunteering. For example, next week, we'll be doing a try a trade event in Kitsap um, for the youth to come and interview us and get interested in the trades. So I think it's always great to give back to the youth. Where I see myself in the future here at the Port of Seattle is right here in the same spot. I love what I do and I hope we continue to grow. 